You know, my principal, Dr. Jackson, you've seen him before, haven't you? She bet me $100 that by the end of football season, I couldn't have this connected on both ends. Shit. By the end of our next football season, we just lost $100, sir. <laughs> you don't think so? Hell no. What? It's already hairs growing in there. Bro. You can put that oil on there and everything. Bro, every and day, bro. Water. Every day. I'm putting stuff on yeah. every day, bro. But this is all only... What is it? We in the beginning of March. This is all two months of growth. I cut this last time in like yeah. the end of December. Yeah, but it's the mm-hmm. same growth that's been there though. You, you nah, grow, you growing hair. It's just growing a little thicker. Nah, but I'm like telling you, not connected. I'm telling you, bro. I gotta give up the dream too. Like my shit, <laughs> my shit starts to grow down like this on yeah. this side, but this side don't connect. Bro, I'm sick. Turn this on my neck like I'm before. Five fifty with Leandro. All these girls on my tattoos. I ain't a player, but I had to. We are, we are, we are, we are. A City Boy Podcast. Welcome back, YouTube, to another City Boy Podcast. We up, we up, we up. When he sleep over there. We up. <laughs> <laughs> Got him lagging. I was looking at, man, I was looking at the docket, man. I was looking at man. the docket, man. <laughs> favorite, favorite podcast in the city. Favorite, favorite light skin host. Hey, 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 hey. Let me start this off with it. You're not light skin. I know. I thought that's what she was gonna say. I'm definitely light skin. I'm not going for that, bro. <laughs> bro uh, hey, go in the comments and tell us if I'm light skin or is he light skin. If Listen. he's light skin, I'm li- look at our complexion. Look at the camp, bro. It's it bro. Does, it don't matter. I'm light skin. I don't know what you're talking about. Listen. Anyways, like I was finna say, bro. <laughs> get on Twitter X, bro. If y'all don't start following the City Boy podcast on there, bro. I'm telling you, I'm gonna start calling niggas out. Winston. You know what I'm saying? It's Winston. All right? <laughs> That's all I got to say. Get on the Twitter. Get on the TikTok. All right? We going crazy. What's up, Chubby? <laughs> <laughs> Trying to take the wave. That's how you started the nigga. it. They fucking with the kid. No, you, you know doing what? that to yourself, sir. Because you hey, ain't man. been playing enough on the playground. Look like you've been <laughs> sitting around. <laughs> Man, I've been playing too swing. much on the playground. No, nah, you, you clearly about? ain't that nigga, kid, <laughs> that nigga the kid sitting on a swing, sad, <laughs> with a snack. <laughs> man. That spent all his friends? lunch money <laughs> literally on double lunches and shit. Hey, man, this is going to be gone less than two months, man. Uh, It's just this, so. just the winter weight, huh? Yeah, that's it, man. You yeah. know what I'm saying? No, that's yeah, that man. in love weight. That lock-in weight. That lock that's in that weight. in love weight. That's that mm-hmm. baking goods, just mm-hmm. chilling weight. Yeah. yeah, I am gonna cat. Yeah, on God, I'm surprised this nigga's not bigger because, let me tell you, <laughs> my God, bro, look at the wrist. I'm telling you, moving forward, for me to feel like I'm laying claim to a woman, I gotta taste your best dish that you can make, mm-hmm. oh, and I if it don't with this. blow my fucking socks off, my nigga. <laughs> I don't know if I can cuff up. Like I was so sick when 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 Winnie, you know, because I I was in a in a long term relationship for so long, and bro, like man, this I'm alone, I'm sad, woo, you know. Then I became single, and then you know he was single for a while too, and mm-hmm. it felt like felt like we had the juice duo back, and then <laughs> out of nowhere he gone, and I'm like, damn, you know. His girl pretty and everything. I'm just like, man. I thought we, I thought, I thought we was gonna, I thought we was gonna go on a run here. You know what I mean? But then he was like, bro, you gotta come over and have dinner with us. I'm telling you, she could cook, bro. Ooh, and you know, niggas say that girl could cook. Oh God, and it don't be like that, Mm-mm. right? Be some great value shit. This nigga, <laughs> I'm telling you, bro. If I was, if I was with his woman. Call me squishy, yeah. <laughs> bro. Make the best, make the best cornbread you'll ever have in your fucking lifetime, bro. And I, bro. I stand on mm. that, bro. On God, and bro, I'm telling you, this is what she did that got me, bro. I'm telling you, that Mississippi roast, you know, where you put like the pepperoncinis, you put the au jus gravy mix and the ranch and the stick of butter, you just let it cook in the in the crock pot. <laughs> I had never had that before, bro. I never ever. Knew about it. She put it over some mashed potatoes. Mm. And she was like, you want some extra juice on there? I'm like, whatever you think I need. Boy. I took a bite, dropped the fork, and just had to look at her like. This nigga called me. He was like, bro, she's making <sighs> dinner this weekend. You got to slide. Um, 
you know, I was telling you about that cornbread, bro. I'm telling you this shit too far. I'm like, this nigga just. And if you know Winnie personally, you know he he be gassing shit up. Oh my <laughs> god. <laughs> No, I don't. Not that it ain't ever where he say it's at, but, yeah. you know, this is the gas master. Over but here. I tell <laughs> no lies, though. But this shit, boy, look, we get in there, dinner ready and everything, and when he make his plate, and he over there, I don't see him touch the main dish at all. He just smacking his cornbread. Nigga took one <laughs> bite and said, <sighs> <laughs> I'm like, this nigga, here he go, you know, King Dragon. <laughs> Gas the shit up. I'm like, this nigga's dragging it. And this was the first time you had it, right? Yeah. yeah. So I, I I made my plate, you know what I'm saying? Mm. I sit I sit down. Was that, what did we have? It was a mud roast. Oh, okay. Yeah. Stupid fire. Dumb. And, <laughs> uh, nigga, I took a bite of that cornbread, kid. Almost fell out your chill. Well, I said, oh, <laughs> shit. <laughs> Damn it. This Damn. nigga. So... For for this to be the the We Up City Boy podcast, and for t- you know these niggas to be all cuffed up and in love and everything, well, ain't nothing wrong with that. I'm in love out here too. It's just with you yourself. Know. He sound like Scotty Pippen after, after MJ retires. <laughs> <laughs> he said, Man, "I'm out here. Somebody got to get these buckets." <laughs> He's- Fuck Somebody it. got to get these buckets. How many shots Kobe took when he scored 81? Nigga, what? Man, <laughs> hella. hella. I do the same shit. But back to this shit. Listen, to be light skin, oh, right? Oh, God. You had to have had all tattoos, grown bro. up That's and light skin? be made fun of and, 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 and be told that you so can't say So this ain't light skin? And, you know, and if, and if you... Then you can't pull no dark skins. I've seen you with dark skins. Seen it. So it's it's to be like it's certain criteria to be considered light skin from a light skin nigga. Now, when you a a a, a, a medium chocolate nigga, like Winnie. Medium chocolate? Listen, his mom and his father are both black. Right? I don't know how he came out this light, but I can't call you light skin. I just can't. Look at my I can't. skin. I can't. I can't. Pull, pull, pull your sleeve up. I pull your sleeve up. I get it. Pull I your hear sleeve. what you're saying. So but I, I just, light. I can't. I can't. Hey, kid, I'm glad you being quiet over there. And <laughs> and it's also in the features, right? When he has big nostrils, that's a nigga tendency. That's a nigga quality. That's just a nigga. And he got drier hair than me. So... Cause you, basically, cause, bro, cause you got you that got half white, white in you. You got the half white in you. That make you light skin. This nigga sound like. <laughs> so Mike, Mike, please, please be the deal breaker. I say as, I'm light skin. He say I'm not light skin. As the blackest nigga in the room, uh-huh. I'ma say in every room. Both of, <laughs> you know what? I'm getting tired of this Drake Aubrey motherfucker. <laughs> That's uh, why he got this highlighter shit on, so niggas can see him. Oh God! I know you can't tell as the viewers, but he do got pants on right now. <laughs> and a hat, and a hat. This nigga, this nigga might be so bright. You know what? I'm not gonna do it. No, yeah. do no, don't do back it. it. All right, nah, come on, come on, kid, kid, nah, kid, do it. kid. Make the decision. Uh, yep. Yeah, now we. Because I'm we saying I'm light skin. Okay. He's saying I'm not light skin. Make this the decision. Nigga, it, when you gonna do the paper brown test or the paper b- bag test? This nigga is light skin. Thank you. He light skin. Thank you. I'm sorry. Leave me alone. And you know, I he he not trying to add him to the light skin legion, but he's in there. He has a pass. I could easily get in. I would easily get admission to the light skin party, right? Exactly. Come on, bro. How's a dark skin nigga gonna give you admission? It doesn't that, matter. That, exactly. <laughs> I'm a dark no. skin nigga. We're no. not gonna go, not over we're not, here. We're not gonna go ask a white person. He's not over here. I'd rather ask a dark. He's nigga. not as dark as his hoodie. I gotta ask. We got we gotta ask another light skin. His his his. Opinion is call inval- one is invalid. It's valid. No, who could valid. I call? I don't know who 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 would answer it. Let's let's see. Call one right now. Let's see. see. Just be like, hey, we live. No, nah, he on the plane. Oh, oh yeah, I call that he nigga city, but he on the plane. On Let the me jet see. Ski. Let me see. This nigga just called me a little bit ago. Yep. Let me see the name. Hunch. All right. Oh yeah. Fellow light skin nigga. Yep. Let's see. Take a break in the action. Yep. <laughs> see if Stand by. Answer. He not gonna answer. He might. He make be, sure you tell him we live. He booed so up know. too. Yeah, big booed up. I'm telling you, it's that season still. Boot up, boot up. 
After like five rings. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh there you go. There you go. There you go. Hunt. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Hold on. Hello? Hunt. You got me? Yes, sir, Ski. You're live on air, brother, on We're, the City Boy podcast. We up. We up. It's Winston no, in the thing. What's going on, world? Hunt, you're, you're, you're the... You're the key deciding factor here, okay? We're, no, we're we having a little argument. We're having a little argument, okay? Mm. Mm-hmm. I know, as a fellow light skin nigga, you're gonna, you're gonna, you're what, what you're gonna say, okay? Yeah. Our viewers want to know. Actually, I want to know. Viewers does, too. Does Winnie get into the light skin club? Absolutely not. <laughs> what? Absolutely not. What like I said. Like how I not, said, please, please explain <laughs> how not. That's his argument. <laughs> how the am co- I not the, light the, skin? The, Look the, at our skin color. The complexion how of his skin. Light skin. But I'm trying to tell him it's different criteria to be considered a light skin nigga, is it not? Yes. Yes. Thank you. Thank you, Hunt. The viewer's not even going to be able to hear that because his mic is covered. Tell him to get a new phone. Thank you, Light Hunt. skin niggas. That's crazy. <laughs> how not? Please, please name two criteria because I'm pissed now. <laughs> You want to know the criteria? Yeah. Now, I need I need two criteria. And I'm yelling into this thing right now if you can't tell. Yeah, you're a little amped up. Here we go. White mom, black dad. <laughs> that, that That's not the only criteria being light-skinned. <laughs> and good hair. Tell him. My dad mom was white, though, so he was a light-skinned. I'm birthed by a light-skinned. <laughs> How am I not light-skinned? <laughs> He going through it over here, huh? I'm good. I'm, I'm, no, I'm he not. I'm, not. I'm sick. Hey, hey, I ain't never seen a dark skin nigga want to be light skin so bad. I'm <laughs> not. So I look like this nigga? I disappear in hey, darkness? Hey, hey Hodge, I'm going to let you go, bro, but I appreciate you, man. No, I don't. <laughs> Tapping in with the pot. Love, bro. That nigga, man. Man, go on to it. a different topic for y'all. Get, for I get pissed. Hey, like I, said, man, like I said, man. Like I said, I'm light skin. <laughs> hey, I'm telling you, viewers, put it in comment. Am I light skin or not? I'm, and we listen. We're gonna count it up after however long. I'm we're like, gonna start a poll listen, on Twitter. Listen, follow listen. The, follow the We Up City Boy podcast on Twitter. We starting a poll. Is Winston light skin? Because you said not light skin, not light skin. That's two light skin. I, I call that nigga light skin. You can't light skin, that's two. Bro. You can't say it yourself. But, to I, make but two. I'm giving yours on your vote too, though. So. But I'm voting How, it on you. So I I'm voting that. on somebody else. But I'm light skinned. <laughs> <laughs> this like, nigga's feeling it. I'm, yeah, bro, because, hey, you got my energy up. I'll tell you that much. Man, what else got your energy up, man? I know y'all boys started practice recently. Stocky. Yeah, we yeah we had a team meeting, and um, Mr. Uh, 26 walked in with a double XL shirt on. <laughs> I said, hey, 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 Mr. Michael. I said, who are you guarding looking like that? <laughs> he said, you. I said, who? Because you play tight end. Yep. And defense. And kid over here is a linebacker. Yep. Um, what are y'all looking forward to this season? Well, first of all, this nigga said he'd been working out since December. I told this nigga, this light-skinned nigga, I don't need till December, my boy. Mm. You still going to get pressed. Mm. And it's even, it'll be even better you get pressed by big kid. What Monique so, say? Ain't no... I'd like to see it. <laughs> boy, ain't no way, boy. I'd like to see boy, it. Boy, ain't no way, boy. You barely going to be able to stand up without ripping them pants, G. You're not guarding me, bro. That's, I'm, that's, t- that's <laughs> even worse. I'm out of there. Bro. You, <laughs> I'm out of there. I got to see You're you going to <laughs> and be in the same place. No. Okay. <laughs> you, okay. Nigga, do got mud and then, and then he going to yell Then he gonna yell at Shaka, I was open. No, the fuck you wasn't. Man, I'm, I'm, y'all Get might make glasses. me tap into a practice just for that. <laughs> Just for that. Well, he got to get in when I get in first. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Ooh, we're gonna, oh, we're, oh, we're going to be in there. We're going to be in there. Hey, Yammer, we're going to be in that bitch. We ain't been in here in a few weeks, man, if y'all could Biggest tell. Niggas a little fired up in this I feel like that's why the energy where it's sad. You could Shoot. cut the tension with a knife. <laughs> y'all niggas hilarious, man. Shit. Dude, what are y'all niggas, man? But, but what y'all feeling like for the for the season outlook, though? Uh, I'm going to say this, you know. Uh, Matter is like... Make sure to stay off the the group chat, the Midwest group chat. But we not on the Midwest group chat. All y'all niggas is ducking. Fuck all y'all niggas. Um, yeah, this ain't the Midwest group chat. This ain't the Midwest group chat. All y'all niggas is ducking. Um, I'm gonna call, I'm gonna call out names. I don't give a fuck. Uh, River City Rough Riders, you're ducking. Uh, Joplin Crusaders, you're ducking. Mm. Inglewood. Wait, 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 wait. Time out, time out, time out. 
Are we talking about the same Joplin crew that we beat in Mini? Yeah. Minneapolis and you mean Stockyapolis. Yeah, I forgot. I forgot that we 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 uh we are new took over to the owners you know? of that. You anyway, know. we're not gonna talk about that team. Anyway, yeah. they didn't want their smoke back. Nope. They get back a month. Did, did he offer the smoke? Did did our did, did our did our top dog offer the smoke back to them? You know, I mean, offer layers we sent. <laughs> I know the smoke was offered. <laughs> That's, That's crazy. Smoke been offered. Uh, Inglewood Bird Gang. Ooh. We said we'll come to y'all. Where's that at? Chicago. Chi Town. Ducking. Ducking. Uh, who else we call? Niggas we went call? to Chicago. I, called, I, we, I couldn't let y'all go out there without me in Chicago. Oh yeah, nah. you, would, I, I, you I wasn't gonna leave without you, so you was coming regardless. Yo. Yeah. I was gonna drag you by the waves, Nick. Yeah, I motherfucking had to know, get some heralds out there. Yeah. Getting older. Told my mama I'd <laughs> I'd uh you know be retired, so I feel like I'm gonna pull a Khabib Nurmagomedov right now. And if I if I told my mother I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it. Just but I still feel the itch. Just do. It I like, bet you do. Just do mm-hmm. it like the WWE superstars. Just come back when the big ones. Yeah, I know. I'm ones. a. We gonna see. I I wouldn't put it put it out of the realm of. Put you your know. hand up. Put your hand up. Put your hand up for me. You gonna have one miss. You got. You gonna have one missing. Yeah. Come on now. Come yeah, on, and you got you got got. Come and through. Mather Mather text me said, uh, "I don't know what your plans are, big dog, but fifteen is ordered in your size and will be held for you to decide." I so told his ass to do it. I appreciate that. <laughs> I said, "That's what he the said." The T ain't going to nobody else. We're gonna say that too. Yeah. That's what he said. Yeah, yeah. He was like, "That's." I, I mean, that's the that's only rifle. Yo, yeah. if he was to let somebody else go out there in your number, bro, that I I, I could I I. I, I quite literally couldn't come back to play if somebody else was wearing my number. <laughs> exactly. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. For I real. just wouldn't do it. Would you go play for somebody else? Just I was about play? to say, I might actually go play for somebody else just to punish <laughs> y'all niggas. Because you know ain't nobody <laughs> fucking with me regardless of what emblem is on a helmet. So if I felt the the uber disrespect like that, yeah, out of there. Got to yeah. dish your right bike, huh? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Man, Stocktown football, you know, about to about to start up in a month. So be on the lookout for that. April twenty seventh. Um, big big game to start off the season. Mm-hmm. Who's it against? Uh, for our for our eleven man season, it's Newton Nighthawks. Yep, Newton. That's a big game because uh, Westbury been talking shit on the book, and yeah. Yeah. I love how niggas talk shit that uh, you know haven't won. It, it ain't yeah. it about your last game? You only as good as your last game, right? Yeah. yeah. And like, what happened the last time we played? Yeah. Oh, it was bad. Trash the niggas. Yeah, they had <laughs> a lot to say two weeks ago. Put that on the news. <laughs> yep. And I don't night. know. I don't know why Matter didn't say like that. That that team more than anybody has been stocking up for the stockmen. So yeah, you know everybody what I'm is. Yeah, because you know everybody Minneapolis is. talking about some. Oh, we about to get the old Warriors back. We about to get the national champion Warriors back. Stop. If it. them niggas actually got the national championship Warriors back, I'd play. Jeez. For sure. For sure. Cause that was the cause cause that was the team that we was like, all right. Yep. Like we lot we we, we, we put them right in the you know what I mean, right in the crosshairs and just yeah. we put them in the line of view and now they in the rear view. Exactly. Because them niggas is ass. I mean, what are they how many times have we played them now? Four? Probably. Probably. Three Four. and one. Wait. Yeah, three and one. And the one time we lost was by one point. One point. Kicker missed three kicks. I ain't, I'm not the type to make no excuses, but y'all niggas suck. Three and one. Yeah, yeah. I was fucking trying, I, I really, I really thought it was five already. DK, Shit. you're a bum. <laughs> so we got to. So because Isaiah Sims, you're a bum. <laughs> and I say names because I don't really give a fuck. Because can't not nan nigga pull up film of you what? doing me dirty at all. But I can pull up solo tackles. Yep. I can pull up solo sacks. Yep. Giving you niggas that fucking work. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Period. <laughs> I, I, I I really feel like when I put a helmet on, I'm untouchable. Ultimus Prime. Exactly. Ultimus Prime. I, I, I transform. Yeah. <laughs> I still got that's that's still your Snapchat name in yeah, my, in my that phone. motherfucker. <laughs> but and that wasn't even self given. You feel me? That's how you know you weird ass niggas out there be giving yourself nicknames and shit, playing sports and yeah. all of that motherfucker. Mm-hmm. When your teammates or opponents give you some shit, you know you that. Yeah. yeah. Facts. Yeah. But uh speaking of football, you know, we've 
past the NFL season, Kansas City Chiefs Super Bowl, go Chiefs. Um, NFL free agency going on right now. Go we we crazy. just we just signed Chris Jones with a four year, hundred twenty one million dollar extension with a hundred and fifteen guaranteed, brother. Nigga said what? We God did? damn, Adam. So they guaranteed the whole four hours ago. Yeah. So they guaranteed the whole contract, but his incentives. Yeah. 115 because that's basically guaranteed. what it is. Yeah. The six million is like incentives. He yeah. gonna get them. He gonna get them. Yeah, that's bitches. just ten sacks a year and, and get and, them and Pro Bowl or All Pro selections. Yeah, man. So, you know what? I'm really disappointed though, kid. And I know you've seen it too. Bro. I know he talking about this nigga Mike Evans, bro. You Fuck is sick. he on? You were sick. I know sick. you were sick. But, but wait though. But wait though. You was finna pay two for fifty two though. I don't care. You would have paid two for fifty two at that receiver. age. I don't give a damn. It, nigga been stacking a thousand every year. We're not gonna say at damn. that age, bro. He's 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 yet to decline. He hasn't yet to fall off. He's yet to decline. I don't give a damn. Pay that man, bro. This no man, matter who his quarterback, this was. man been playing with bums at quarterback, and he bums. always get a thousand yards minimum, minimum. His since his rookie year, this nigga's never. Even when he get hurt, bro, the motherfucker done missed like six games yep. in a season one time. Still got still that. got a thousand. The season he missed six games with Tom, he had 1,020 yards mm -hmm. in 12 games. That's, My nigga, that's, that's insane. That's 120 yards a game. Mm -hmm. Nuts. What's your team been doing in free agency? Giants. We haven't done nothing in free agency, but they... Uh, the well, free agency starts next week. Yeah, I am about to say the know, franchise deadline, deadline was on Tuesday, I believe. Or maybe... I, think, I no, believe it was Tuesday. Yes, yesterday, like the whole NFL season starts... Yesterday. No, 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 no. It's on the 13th. Is it on the 13th? Yeah. It's on the 13th. I'm thinking but about the franchise tag deadline was on Tuesday at 4 p.m., right? Mm -hmm. We did not do a transitional tag on Xavier McKinney or franchise tag Saquon Barkley. Mm -hmm. But we already had said that we wasn't going to do that. Yep. Mm -hmm. So, like, it doesn't make me more worried, but, like, I just don't think teams are going to pay Saquon Barkley what he is asking us to pay him. Yeah. So I That's think, truthfully and honestly, he's going to hit the open market, right? Houston, they're going to call. L.A. is going to call. Mm -hmm. Chargers, you mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? All, Philly, Dallas, all those teams are going to call him, but, like, nobody's going to pay him what he wants, bro. Absolutely. Yeah, and if I'm him, if I'm a running back, I'm going, see, like a receiver, a receiver has that, the capability to draw in all those M's, right? Mm -hmm. And being a top receiver like a Mike Evans, you have the power within negotiations and everything like that because there's not a lot of me, mm -hmm. right? And there's not a lot of no-name niggas getting a 1,000 yards. Yep. Nope. There's a lot of no-name niggas at running back that, that are like eating six-round pick. Not a no-name, but like Isaiah Pacheco, right? Yep. Yeah. Six-round pick. Going yep. crazy. He's on a rookie deal making 800000 a year, yep. less than an M. Going crazy. Feel me? And he got two Super Bowl rings. Exactly. Doing and all that work. By, 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 by Cheeks going so crazy, the other 31 teams in the league are looking like, damn, do we got to pay a, a motherfucking running back? Yeah. Ten milli a year? Plus, no, we don't. He wanted, he wanted us to give him like 19. Yeah. Exactly. Which is crazy work. Yeah. I understand that you may feel like you're worth 19 M's to the Giants. Yeah. But that's because we're asking you to run behind the worst line in NFL history. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Qu quite literally. And also, it's a whole open market. You got Austin Eckler, Derrick Josh, Henry, Derrick Henry, Josh, Josh Jacobs. Jacobs. But it's, then also, they're going to look at the draft like, why do I need to pay any of y'all niggas? I can get somebody off the board. Somebody, but somebody off the board, off younger. Cheapy. 100%. 100%. Because th wasn't that a running back that just broke the 40 record? Mm. No, that no, was a receiver. That was a wide well, receiver. That oh, okay. Chiefs going to get. He's going to the Chiefs. He's going to the Chiefs. He's going to the Chiefs. But look, we'll look, we'll look up. He's faster than Tyreek. I see it from Saquon's side, though, because yep. if you look at the Giants, like you gave Daniel Jones, Jones. four for 140. Yeah. And y'all about to discard this nigga. Oh, yeah. Oh, he's out after next year, guaranteed. But again, yeah. it's still the same shit, bro. Like, you can't you can't make the same argument. Because you're not a quarterback. Because yeah. exactly. You're not a story. Like, he had yeah. to get paid starting quarterback money. But yeah. it's really what – it's 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 really monkey see, monkey do, what the rest of the league is doing, right? Yep. Exactly. Because there's no other team that doesn't have a franchise guy at QB – 
making a playoff run. Exactly. Feel me? Yeah. Every other team that was in the playoffs this year got a franchise Charged guy. Yeah. Texans, they got CJ Stroud. That's a franchise guy. Bills, franchise guy. Yep. Patty, franchise guy. Exactly. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Trevor Lawrence, that's a franchise guy. Yeah. Justin right? Rich is a franchise guy. Daniel James Jones Hurt. isn't a franchise guy, guy, but to keep him in the position where he was in, you had to pay him like a franchise guy, right? Exactly. So you don't see no other teams with a bum at quarterback making it far. Yeah. You can see other teams with a bum at running back making a deep playoff yeah. push. But also, it's not the old market. It's not the 1990s or the 2000s. And it's not and the same game anymore. And then, you like, y'all rivals, the, the Cowboys, they paid Zeke all that damn money. Where'd that go to? The year, right, the year they paid them, Tony Parler went off. Mm-hmm. Took off. And... And I don't think I think he literally had injury after injury after injury after yep, injury that after too. injury that on too. during his decline, right when they paid him. Right yep. that there, you know what I mean. So like, and and I literally nobody watches the Giants like I do, bro. Mm-hmm. If you put Saquon Barkley highlights from his rookie year when he I believe he was rookie of the year that year. Yes, he was. And his him playing last season when he ran when he was second in the league in rushing with like thirteen hundred, bro. Mm-hmm. He's not the same. Not the this same. rookie Saquon was throwing up deuces because you're not catching me, bro. Yeah. Jumping on my You know what yeah. I mean? He made like six niggas miss against the Eagles, bro. Yep. One game. And the, the announcer is literally incredible. Yep. Incredible. But like, bro, you watch now, he had those same creases, bro, and he's just not going nowhere. Yeah. He's getting caught. You know what I mean? 40, 50 yard runs. That should have been 70 yard touchdowns. Honestly, you just got to be fresh and you, if you're running yep. back. And so, honestly. I'm okay. Now, Xavier McKinney's a little bit different story. He wants to reset the safety market. We're not, yeah. nobody, that four, four, four top safeties just got released yeah. in the last week. Exactly. He's not, he's not going to, he's not going to get what he thinks he's going to get if he thinks he's going to reset the market and ain't going to be with us. Yeah. So, so and I don't also, know. also on that, you know, I just got, I just, as a Chiefs fan, I got to say, the Broncos, I don't know what the fuck y'all doing, but I appreciate y'all. Niggas tweeting. Niggas wilding out, bro. bro. They, gave up, y'all. they gave up, they gave up, Three players, three <laughs> second round picks, two first round picks, a fifth round pick, and paid him two hundred and fifty two million to cut him and have to pay eighty five and dead, eighty five dead. Broncos country, let's, let's ride. ride. <laughs> Broncos country, I'm out, bro. Because like, what is? And you know, you know what's gonna be stupid is I bet you the Giants might are probably gonna sign him. Yeah, most likely, or because he's a veteran, he's honestly, the best veteran probably on the market. This free agency is gonna be up in the air, but like the the Chargers, y'all got a new coach and Harbaugh. You gotta learn the system. Probably gonna take y'all another year. Raiders I'm gonna flood these niggas. Bro. <laughs> y'all ain't got the quarterback, <laughs> you know. So it's gonna get real ugly, bro. I'm AMC trying to tell you. West champions ten times, and that's the in thing. The in the off season, in in these next. Upcoming few weeks, mm-hmm. bro. I seen some reports that said we might, we might got a package we could send the Vikings for Jettas. <laughs> Shit! If we got Jettas, I'm going dumb. I'm gonna keep it a buck with y'all. I'm good with letting Travis Kelsey go if we got Justin Jefferson. Nah, not yet, not yet. I'm good at I'm good with putting him in a package deal for that, bro. Justin Jefferson's 26 years old, bro. Travis Kelsey's 34. Nah, because the other tie is we, we got is boo boo. I don't care. I the don't next, care. You, see, you see Travis go up to the fucking Andy, put me in the motherfucking game. That's Jettas. I know, but boy. nah. That's Jettas. That's our safety blanket. That's our safety blanket. I ain't even going to lie, bro. Out of here. I ain't even going to lie. If that would be fire, because yeah. I would honestly do the same thing. I would be okay with Travis. I know Chiefs yeah. country. I know y'all would be hurt. I know y'all would hate the GM. Who? Why would you trade Travis Kelsey? But listen. I can't. Travis Kelsey's best days are behind, behind him. him. Yep. Nah. Facts. I, I, Jettis, no, I, no, listen, listen, Jettis listen. Jettis shit is right now. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Jettis is right. He just got hurt. He's finna, He's about to come back so hungry. Nah, we can't. I'm telling that. you, I, I would do that way. too. Even nah. if that mean lo- losing that. Who's that rookie receiver y'all got? Rasheed Rice? Uh, Rice, yeah. Even if it meant losing him too. That's what I'm saying. He can go. We ain't, si- we ain't signed 25. I'm not even going to say your little bum ass name. Can't run through the goddamn gaps. Who not, cried? We're not signing that nigga no more. Um, who else is up there? We had the franchise need. Yeah, I'm the franchise tag him. Yes, sir. That nigga ain't going nowhere. Yes, sir. <laughs> what, was the, what, was the, what was the pri- what was the price tag on there? Like I, he won it. He won some. He won some. Uh, his no, shit what's was the like franchise 11. tag number? Oh, I think ours. Yeah. Oh, he's pissed. Bro, we got like 60 M's to play. But Chris with. was pissed too last year. But and he just got paid. We just told him like, hey, y'all. 
Right, guy. chill. Just chill. 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 We're going to get you the Chill. We're going to get this ring. <laughs> We're going to get these rings. Chill. We're going to get y'all that bag. But we got to get these rings. rings right now. Man, keeping it on sports, though, let's pivot off football. Um, news broke today. Mike Tyson versus Jake Paul. What what, what are niggas thinking, bro? Tyson, knock this nigga hey, out. Hey, bro, please. listen. If Jake Paul beats Mike Tyson. The world's over. Like I'm never, I'm, I might fake. never watch another boxing match. Never, again. Bro. only gonna watch never. UFC because you can't, you. you can't fake you. UFC. I'm telling you, I would never watch another boxing match. I mean, again, and bro. it, and and the oh, no, because I, I still watch. Because first oh, off, God, I still watch. Bud. Yeah, my but. thing is like, granted, Jay Paul has been training professionally boxing for a while, so he probably give me to work. Pause. But Mike Tyson, <laughs> don't do that, bro. Don't. <laughs> I fucking keep, keep going, keep going. No, no, Mike niggas. Tyson. I hate dark <laughs> He's going to say that. I hate dark skins. <laughs> I didn't say that. The light skin bro. civil war has begun. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, son, where'd you find this one? <laughs> bro, but no, for real though, because I know y'all have seen the video of Mike uh, sparring. Yeah. Or uh, hitting the mats. Yeah. Hitting the pads. Bro, even the nigga holding the pads is like, oh, shit. <laughs> like. I know that nigga hit hard. And Still. he don't do nothing but smoke bud and read Still. books, nigga. Still. <laughs> and if if Jake Paul go in there and whoop him, bro, all hope is lost, bro. Because you know Jake Paul's not going to fight no, no nigga his age. He's not going to fight no Ryan Garcia. He's not going to fight a Devin Haney. He's Niggas not going to fight a, shit out of a, a, a fucking Benavidez. You know yeah. what I mean? He's not going to fight nobody like that, right? So... In his mind, he's like, okay, I'm fighting Mike Tyson. If I whoop him, nobody can tell me shit. Whereas real niggas know, like, regardless of how good Mike look on the bags, the motherfucker's still 58 years old, bro. He's damn near 60. It's like that shit would just be. Like, I damn near don't even want to watch it for real, but I'm going to. Right. But I'm saying that's the state of the sport of boxing. Yeah, it's like, it's, it's just a joke. It's a joke now. And I hate it because I'm the biggest Mike Tyson fan in the world. I got a Mike if, Tyson hoodie. If I got to see this motherfucker Jake Paul knock out arguably the greatest boxer of all time. Yeah, that's my goat. I'm going to lose my motherfucking mind. Bro, because do y'all <laughs> did the niggas ever just get on YouTube and Look up Mike Tyson highlights. I see I used every to, single one. I used to see them. I, I used to see them all the time because I watched Muhammad Ali a lot. I've seen a lot. Com- I've seen compilations of Mike just like walking to the ring and seeing the utter fear in these niggas' eyes, bro. He was a killer. At 13. A mauler. Going to ass niggas out. That man was crazy. My favorite picture is when he's in the ring and it's just him. He got like five security guards. No, no, no. Those were cops after oh, he yeah, bit cops. Buddy's yeah, ear off. Yeah, yeah. No, that was not security hey, cops. Like, yeah. Spit the ear out too. Like, but bro, what mind frame? Like, you think, like, what do you got to be thinking to bite a nigga ear off? The craziest thing is, think about how hard he had to bite to get Evander ear off. He did it twice. Because the niggas are wearing mouthpieces. He did it twice, yeah. That's yeah. all bottom teeth. You're right, you're right. He did it twice. So that's that's rubber and teeth just yanking Ooh. the ear off. And you know, because Evander was like, like, what the fuck? Yeah. I and, can't Im- Are you just imagining, like, getting your ear bit off? Yeah. You bro, because I'm trying to imagine the same thing. I like, get my ear bit off and then knocked out by Mike Tyson, honestly. Wait what? I know, I know that nigga hit. Wait what? Hard. You'd okay. rather pause. Would you take a Mike Tyson uppercut? Oh, jog <laughs> for for two M's, two million, two yeah, yeah. 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 Can, yeah. Wait, wait, wait. Can I get a mouthpiece? Huh? Wait, wait. No. Yeah, you get I a get mouthpiece. A mouthpiece? Cool, I, but I no get... headgear, no nothing. I, yep. I have a better. <laughs> I have. A, I have a better question. Do I get medical insurance? No. It is, nah, man. It's 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 <laughs> you standing next to a briefcase with two million in there, and a pissed off Mike Tyson, <laughs> and he's throwing a single solo uppercut. Two milli, two milli. All right, listen. Glove only if you'll take this side bet. If I don't fall, double, bro. <laughs> I'm just <laughs> saying. Nigga said if I don't fall, double. But as long as you take that. Yeah. Spaghetti. 
That nigga legs was finna look like one of them things out in front of the in front of the spaghetti, spaghetti, spaghetti. He wanted them everything. That nigga leg, bro. Bro, I don't even know that because my thing yeah. is, I'm thinking, you know, obviously you think monetary and you're like, oh yeah, two M's. Two mil. But bro. Think about the repercussions, that's bro. Like that's my what I'm saying. Like your like, head, that's what I'm your brain just jumbled up in there. That's what I'm saying. I need that med. You gonna wake up thinking your name is Tyson Mike? Cause that nigga hit you so hard. You know what I'm saying? You might have some of his memories. Nigga done knocked your shit so loose you can't even remember your second. You know what I'm saying? Your can't remember grade. your mama name. Who don't remember their second grade teacher name? Not after that. <laughs> Not after that, goddamn! Hey. Gonna beat your ass. Hey, glove, no glove. Glove. All right, good. Yeah, I can, bro. I but can they say it. a glove make it worse. Yeah, huh? it's worse. You got yeah, because you crazy. got you got no, six I inch feel like, padding. I feel like the knuckle. The knuckle is worse, gotta honestly, because be you got six inch padding. Bro, they so. say bare knuckle boxing is is less on your brain than that's because that's because you get one hit. And you get knocked out. But, like, gloves, you get hit multiple times in multiple rounds. Bro, fuck, that stiff-ass leather Mike used to wear, bro. That shit. The that nigga, shit what? <laughs> I'm telling you. Like, <laughs> like, bro, the nigga might hit you so hard in your chin, you no longer growing hair there. Right? You just got a patch and a story to tell. And then he used to be like this before. I, man, yeah. I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. That's a, that's a question for y'all, man. Two M's for it. For a, for a, Uppercut. No flinch uppercut from this nigga Mike. Iron man. Mike. Hey, go watch that his Hulu um movie, Tyson. That shit is hard. Man, I know y'all uh I know y'all lover boys and shit, and I, I for damn sure am, and I've been on that uh Love is Blind Tough. Y'all been watching that? Man. Nigga. Man, talk about some city boy shit. Nigga. God, That's damn. Definitely, bro, and it's crazy too because like they really and like first of all, let, let's 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 all let's all agree on this, right? The directors, the Lachey's or whatever they name are, they messy as fuck. Messy than a bitch. Cause they get the all they do with they and like when they get together, they get them motherfuckers drunk as hell and just turn the cameras on. Like they are so messy, bro. Like that shit is that shit is fucking crazy. Messy. But like the the like I think the whole love of love is blind thing is crazy work. Crazy. Would, would you go on it? Hell no. I gotta know what you look like. Cause I ain't about to end up like, oh dude. Yeah, people say I look like a celebrity. Oh, really? What celebrity? Megan, Megan Fox. Fox. <laughs> <laughs> they said Megan Fox. <laughs> <laughs> Megan not. <laughs> oh, God. You see when he opened that door, he was like. Oh, God, bro. He really said. <laughs> said Megan Fox. I can think of 10 other animals. <laughs> Bitch look like Megan Dog. Megan Aardvark. Megan Horse. But it's not Megan Fox. That's for damn sure. But the crazy thing is, bro, when 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 Chelsea told Jimmy she looked like Megan Fox, did you see this nigga write that down in his notepad so quick? He said, he said Megan Fox. No, 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 bro, bro, bro. I'm telling you. He said, yeah. She was like, yeah, you know, I, I, a lot of people say I look like Megan Fox. He said, what? Wait, wait, he said, wait, what did you say? She said, yeah, Megan Fox. He said, bro. It's not right. Like, he Megan wrote, Fox? In bold letters, nigga put Megan Fox. <laughs> then he married her the next day. Then nigga had the nerve to say, you lied to me. <laughs> On God. <laughs> On he God. Did. He did. Oh, On God. <laughs> and he be pulling her fucking car with her homegirls and everything. He was, she said, uh, you guys want to know the biggest lie she told me? I said, yo, cousin. Yeah, yo. Clay. Clay a whole curb ass nigga. Bro, first off, <laughs> hey, how yo. you going to... How you gonna whole time? Whole time. You gonna go on a show about getting married, but whole time tell her like, yeah, I don't, I don't know if I get married because I just don't want to cheat on you. Like, I just don't want to be put in a position to cheat on you, my nigga. As a nigga, you already know, like, bro, you are. You don't have to cheat. You gotta <laughs> cheat. You don't have to. Black men don't cheat. You don't gotta be in no position to cheat because you don't gotta cheat. You don't have to cheat. <laughs> that nigga claim, bro. Like, bro. These niggas got whole girlfriends. They still pop out with me, nigga. Right? We, we, we'll still pop out to the bar. We don't have to cheat. Nope. You don't gotta nope. do nothing, nope. bro. You feel me? You don't. That's crazy. This nigga, nigga waited. talking about. My dad used to take me on missions, so that shit fuck with me. I get it. My pops did too. I get it. <laughs> this nigga. 
<laughs> we gonna edit that out. Hey, damn, I can't believe. <laughs> Hey, Kid needs some therapy. Same. He felt clay. That nigga said, on oh God. <laughs> on oh God. Squishy gonna see Squishy this part like, over like. Like, hold on. What you mean your oh. dad did too? What oh. you mean, oh God? Oh, she you don't want to get married because cause you don't want to cheat? Oh, that nigga's wild and flock. Wow, bro. She, hey, I ain't gonna lie too, bro. And, and, and Big Big literally said this the other day. He said, bro, after that speech she gave, man, I ought to give her a kid. Love, double love, like every bro. What? Yeah. Like if that that made me feel uplifted. Man. Yeah. I looked at my girl like, bro. When man. she said, "It's a partnership," and when you're feeling down, I'm here to bring you up. Yeah. And I need that from you too. When I'm down, I need you to bring me up with woo. He over there like, yeah, yeah. I just hope I don't cheat. Said, wow. Niggas really ain't shit. This nigga said that that's probably the biggest nigga ain't shit moment of the year. Uh, easy. <laughs> you gonna <laughs> no. you gonna go on a show uh, this about, year. No, uh, this is, year. Cause, Cause you're gonna go on a show intended to get married. Yep. You're gonna ask a woman to marry you, but then after the fact be like, it's just not responsible if I say yeah, because nah. I just don't know if I'm nah. in a place right now that I it's wouldn't. It's even worse. On. This nigga waited the very last moment. Yeah. You add it. I respect old dude before because he's like, "Are you ready?" And she's like, "Oh, we got our weddings planned for like next week." He's like, "I don't think I'm ready." This nigga Clay is at the motherfucking altar after she gave a sensational speech. That's why I'm saying Filled her I heart, see. and she looked good in that fucking dress, boy. Your Lord, mom, the mama's getting was long. Hey, but she was Chocolate. she was about to pile a little cushy on the wall while she walking down the aisle. Ad was like, Chocolate. he's Ooh. like. I don't think I'm ready right now, and I don't care what anybody. Nigga, what? I look bro. at it, nigga. I'm on, I'm on the laptop, and I was like, "Bro, this nigga." So y'all y'all seen the last episode, right? The whole weddings and shit, yeah. bro. Crazy because then the other couple that actually finna get that actually got married, they over here like tweaking like, <laughs> "Oh, we can't have sex. Like, you're not on birth control, and I don't have a vasectomy, so we probably shouldn't do it." Like, cause he. What did Trojan make them joints for? Man, what? <laughs> I'm confused. What? And if it's not Trojan, there's 10 other brands. <laughs> like, if, what are we doing? If not, you got the old school method. Because, <laughs> bags, pull out or get a plan B in the morning. What are we yeah, talking about? Bro. We finna eat that like a candy. These are sweet tarts, bitch. <laughs> what? Bro, I'm telling you, <laughs> you, bro, bro, because I feel a, bro, I, bro, this, listen, this. listen, I sell, I sell whips. I've never sold a whip to somebody that come in and be like, I'm going to take that. No test drive. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Right. And let's say, girl, unless you going to buy the car without test drive? brand new. Right. Yes. But if you done had some sex before, yeah. you're not brand new. Sorry, you can't be born again. <laughs> you, your your wholeness doesn't go away. It doesn't. Right? So they've both had sex before, and you trying to tell me you ain't. You not going to do it because you're not a birth show and you don't have a... I said, bro. You're not going to taste what? the cookie because they ain't got about? a rapper? What? what? Facts. Oh, no. If you think I would ever, <laughs> ever in fucking lifetime get married without at least a little... Just a, little, a, little, a little nibble, a little something. You feel me? I I at least gotta know what the know what the, know what the top be like, yeah. And I, I gotta see what them buns look like from the back. And she like, she like in the, bro. I'm saying, saying I know can, calm. Can, I know that it's fire. I know it's fire, bro. Who who? Amy. She oh, like know that joint. She like I, I know that mother crack. <laughs> bro. He talking about dumb as hell. Me. Could y'all go on Love is Blind? No, I can't do it. I Couldn't do it. Why not? I think because after the pods, we all know what the fuck it is. I need to know what the fuck you look like. When that nigga seen Amy and she just had that stiff back, he was like, he's like, you, you kind of lied to me. And she's like, oh, about my tattoos. Nah, bitch. <laughs> you know exactly what you like to be about. <laughs> when, when buddy and when, but then when just, he seen old girl, the, when, the mom, he's like, bro. yeah. So it's a no for you. Hell no. Couldn't do it. What about you, Winnie? Mm, I feel like I would 
love the idea of it. Yeah, facts. And it would sound fun. But I, I, I'd have to make it out the pods without proposing. Bro, my yeah. thing is, I, I wouldn't have no problem. Mm-mm. Like, I would love to go on the show. Mm-mm. I ain't going to cap. You know, and being a lover boy at heart, Mm-mm. you feel me? It's the conversation that get me to fall in love anyway. If you can make me feel yeah, me on guard, if you can you make, can me, make laugh. me laugh and do all that stuff, right? That's what really reels you in. But what gets me to bite is that ass. <laughs> I was, I was, I was, is that face? I was just about to call this nigga out. Teeth. The way you smell. Just, you know what I'm saying? I was just about to call this nigga out. Oh God! Oh God! <laughs> What's your toes looking like right now, shirty? Yeah. Right? Because oh God. so I, I I I would go. I'm going on the show. Facts. No. If they came to Omaha, I'm going. But the problem is, if they came to Omaha, they'd be like, I'd be like, "What's your name?" I'd be like, "Do, do you know? Do you know Dev? Do you know Glenn? Do you know? No, you do." She'd I'm be out. like, "Hello, <laughs> hello." Hey, Ain't nobody hey, hey, on no, the no, other no, side, no. bitch. She gonna hear the door close. Do. <laughs> Ain't nobody on the other side, shorty. Uh, uh, Alex, but. I'd have to be realistic in saying mm. if them doors open and shorty don't look good, experiments over. At, at right right there. Huh? Over because bro, but you gotta it propose don't matter. by the end though. Yeah, I would have that's then. what I'm saying. You gotta propose to get him to open the door. That's what I'm saying. I would have no problem getting to that point. It would just be and I also sometimes I feel like you could tell how a woman looked by her voice, right? Like, close your eyes and listen to AD. You know she's at least a seven. Right? Nope. Jessica, the EpiPen bitch. Close your eyes and listen to how she talk. You know she's a seven. You know it. Mm-mm. So, if 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 who? Because Chelsea's voice is annoying. I would have never. <laughs> the big would have told me she looked like Megan Fox. I I, stop it. I can hear it in your voice. <laughs> I can hear it. <laughs> you, yeah, you he said she, she, she shot up too far. <laughs> oh, speaking oh of that, that, that shotgun grip chin. She, that bitch, <laughs> boy, hell no. Grip chins. <laughs> but I'm just, I just would have to keep it a buck. I'm way too fucking shallow yeah. for them doors to open and you not, you not appease me. I was about to say. To be able to keep this shit going, Flock. Yeah. I'm get married? To. Oh, get, I'm a cheat. <laughs> Niggas don't got it. I'm a cheat. I'm a cheat. I'm a cheat. Bitch, <laughs> you don't look. You don't. You don't. Uh, uh, uh. Sorry. He you coming home. Me? He coming home late. Like old girls. Like I seen you at your ex house five o'clock. Yeah, I was there. Yeah. <laughs> I was there. I'm sorry. And now I'm on a show getting close. Now my IG followers going up. <laughs> Fuck it. It's an experiment. I, but but bro, I be god. Damn. <laughs> so, so if if che- let's just say Chelsea's voice was a little bit different, right? Mm-hmm. And I was the one, you know, she made you laugh, woo woo, and she came out. You turn it right back around. You not even gonna walk out. I'm the- not walking out, bro. What did she take off running at you? I'm telling like you, she did. I'll I'll save, I'll save face for that episode, right? Mm. Y'all not gonna see me on the next one though. <laughs> like, what happened behind the scenes? You gotta show the behind the scenes clips because yep. I would have to just keep it a buck. Yeah. Especially right now. Come on, baby. <laughs> Stop it, man. I'm I it I'm sorry. I I am how I am who I am. I am who I am. And you aren't who you said you were. <laughs> You ain't no fucking Megan Fox. You ain't no fucking Megan, Megan Fox, Fox. goddamn. The other girl was more Megan Fox than. For real. Bro, what Lord. was her name? Uh, I forgot. Uh, uh, Jessica? Yeah. The, the one that had the kids? Bad. 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 Bad little bad. Mm-hmm. And she was stiff. She was like, don't play with me. Bro. Either it, you want me or not. She up. said, you're like. going to need an EpiPen. I said, Lord have mercy. Yeah, she said, you're going to need an EpiPen without to me. open up your airways when you see me. Boy, I would have I would have been like, you know what? Yeah. yeah. That's, a, that's how you know she got it. I was kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Joke's on you. <laughs> I'm you know, on a knee. You thought I was playing, I'm on a knee. Right? You can't see me here. You can't see me here, brother. I'm on a knee, brother. Check, check. Tuesday. I'm on their ass. I'm calling an audible. Check. Omaha. Check. Omaha. Facts, huh? What? Bro, and you said, you said Clay had the biggest city. 
the no, the biggest city boy moment was that nigga Jeremy getting on the jet skis with Shorty in front of the other one. I yeah. said, oh, shit. Yeah. And what your caller was trying to call her out. She was like, so you don't think you're wrong for sending that, that DM? AD, she, yeah. she dead wrong. She, she's she like, dead they're wrong. They're wrong. wrong. Facts. Dead wrong. Dead wrong. You knew exactly she what knew was She knew exactly what the fuck she was doing. Yeah. <laughs> but my thing is, though, when you really think about it, right, the experiment is what, six weeks? Yeah. Right? No, I don't know. Four yeah, weeks, whatever it is, weeks, right? Yeah. So how wrong is she? Because you don't necessarily really know somebody. No, right? you don't. You don't and even... we had a connection too. So if you figure if you find out that this girl isn't who you thought she was or whatever, yep. or this this guy ain't who you know you thought he was, yep. hit me. Exactly. I don't necessarily see the flawed shit within that. Yeah. But I can I can uh, resonate with the perspective of a Laura who, who's the girl, who's the fiance, right? Because I feel it, but also like he don't really know you, yeah, right. Y'all was talking through a he wall, kn- or 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 to not even say he don't really know you, he know me just as much as he know you. Exactly. Facts. So we spent we dated him for the same time, Pause. Yeah, exactly. pretty much. Facts. So exactly. and he's going off of a split hair decision. You're not you're not you're going you're not going no. off of, you're yeah. going off a set time. So she is, is a probability. Yeah, game when he cut when baby. he cut the EpiPen girl off, I can't think of her name. When he cut her off, I said, This nigga tripping. Because he's about to go choose nigga what? And she was divorced and she had been married before. <laughs> Ain't nothing wrong with being married before, but she said, I'm not cool with you going out. I don't want to be with somebody. <laughs> I don't want to be with somebody who goes out all the time. He said, "I'm gonna take a step back." Then, Deuces. but would it, but also though, how would you feel though? How because remember how his the, his homegirls mm-hmm. he had ended up fucking one of them. Yeah, bro. So like, how would you and vice versa if your shorty one of her friends, but had fu- but she fucked <clears> before? It's that's that's flawed too because it, I don't on know if him, you watched it. I'm on I'm, I'm on her because. Even Jimmy was like, the first person you called when we was got off the ex, pods was your ex-boyfriend, ex. who you said you're now best friends with. Yeah. Oh, see, I forgot see, that. I just hunched Shorty, and now we're friends. Exactly. You was hunching and dating this nigga, and now y'all are friends. It's completely different. Yeah, that is different. It's the principle behind the shit. Plus you know what I'm saying? Rolls. And you know, women, <laughs> <laughs> quite literally, <laughs> cannot think with principle in mind. They yeah. just can't do it. And they can. I would let's, let's not say that they can't. I think that they. Don't. They cannot. They, str- they yeah. struggle. They cannot. Yeah. They can never let a nigga go. They cannot. Speaking of uh, love is blind, and in 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 you know we we've been talking about Clay for a little bit. You know we are gonna wrap this up up, but I want to touch on this real quick because it's fucking insane. But but remember when Clay said who his role models was? He said Will Smith. Mm-hmm. In P. Diddy. Gents. What the fuck is going on with P. Diddy right now, bro? Puffy. Puff. Diddy. Sean Combs. This nigga's wild. You been seeing the reports? I mean, a little bit, but fill me in. Gang bangs, rapes, fucking sexual assaults. I mean, wasn't he supposed to be on, like, Epstein Island, too? Yeah. Some wild ass shit. He like calling other niggas daddy. I'm not going to talk about it. <laughs> Yo! I don't even call my father daddy. <laughs> nigga, what? What are you talking about? Pause. My that didn't even said, feel good coming out right there. No. My pops said, don't call me that shit. Call me pops. Yeah. That was at two years old. What the fuck are you talking about? I call my father father. <laughs> he said, he said so you deserve bad. that, daddy. Nigga, what? Pop, father. I would have been like, oh, hey, yo, what you just say? <laughs> right. Daddy. My man, my son ain't I, I I couldn't tell you the last time my son said that shit. Man, what? just as a boy, you know at some point the dy at the end of dad fall off. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Mommy, whatever. But calling your father daddy, that's, that's crazy. Wild. But no, the uh the producer, one of the producers that worked on his last album mm-hmm. sent out uh you know, what do they call that? An affidavit or whatever. Yeah. And in the affidavit, he he claims to have just killer proof of his claims uh-huh. that Diddy was grooming him, um, you know, 
and like I've seen videos now, you know, running on TikTok and shit, yeah. where Justin Bieber like stayed at Diddy's house when he was thirteen and like was weirded out and shit. Like the baby just put something out there that he went to his house and you hear him stumbling and mumbling. Like they said, a uh, a uh, a uh, a uh, 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 Columbus Short. Yeah, he was on an interview. He said that Diddy called him after the Hip Hop Awards talking about, yo, <laughs> it's Sean. Come to the hotel. We having a party. He said, who's we? Who's all there? He said, shit, it's just me. Slide. Nigga, what you mean? We having a party. <laughs> Where the hoes? <laughs> hey, hey, He's like, I'm at the bread. Where, where the business at? He's like, nah, nah. He, <laughs> Bro, nah, I daddy, it's just me, Paul. <laughs> if, 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 if a nigga hit me, like, slide over to the party, bro, I pull up and it's just you. Square up, nigga. Man, what? Because fuck you got. He got, 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 on, he got the robe on with the champagne. Nigga, what the fuck we do? <laughs> I'm like, oh, yeah. Boom. <laughs> You can't get one off on me. Nigga, I'll, 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 I'll no reason. Tupac and playing your ass. No whiskey. What the? F- That's what did he on G? Dang. Yeah. I know you was on some bullshit when you fucked your, your son's girl with Lori Harvey. Yep. But now you on some other shit. Bro, because the cashy shit was enough. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. And the cashy shit was so damning. This nigga settled out of court. For me, honestly, if you settling out of court, you guilty as fuck. Wait, what? What? What did he do? Cassie, Cass- what happened? Cass- oh. Like made her he- have sex with other people. Made it. Yep. He'd watch. He like beat on her and everything. And she had all this evidence and she's, stuff. They settled out of court. They settled like out of court. Thirty million. Settlement. Quick, quick. Settlement quick. Niggas paying thirty m's quickly within the week. What uh, what Kanan say? To Tariq, <laughs> I know your dad a long time. They say he, he did, did that, that shit. shit. He did that shit. He did, he did that, that shit. shit. <laughs> I'm surprised Guilty he's not claiming that nigga right now. Oh, you bro, you know, you know, Fifty <laughs> just can't wait for that. Can't fucking wait for that. I can't wait bro, for that, that shit. I'm still shocked. That's what Diddy on, bro. Man, bro, shit. crazy. Man, we uh, we ain't been in here in a minute, but uh, boy, it's been like two weeks. Yeah, about. Two weeks. We're gonna start getting y'all with the with the weekly episodes, yes. pumping out more content. Um, you know, kid transitioning um into a different profession right now. Mm-hmm. Uh, you know, me and Winnie been busy as hell too, football starting up, but just know that uh we're really about to attack these next few months, especially coming in the summer, because we got a lot of things planned, a lot of parties, um and, and, and things like that. So we're gonna pump out the content. Yo. Get it to y'all. We appreciate y'all tapping in, viewing with us every week. Um, makes like when he started the episode off, man. It's, it's important, man. Support, please. We'd appreciate it. Uh, the TikTok, Twitter, Instagram. It's all, X now. <laughs> X. <laughs> yep. It. You know, you can you can you can look at some titties on Tuesday, and you can <laughs> you can watch some We Up City Boy podcast clips on Wednesday. Goddamn. Yeah. Exactly. Perfect place. <laughs> Perfect place. Yeah. So follow all our socials. I right. believe they're all the exact same, right? Yep. We up City Boy Pop. Yep. And then you know, shorter clips are gonna be uploaded on Facebook, YouTube. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna put the put the uh, post out right now. City Girls, we casting right now. I keep trying to cast City Girls, but y'all not friends no more. <laughs> <laughs> Women and their friends. We are gonna touch on that next. We are gonna pod. touch on that next file, but y'all City can Girls never keep no friends. City Girls and they influence Man, they, they girls too. And they've been locked in for ten. <laughs> Man, ten what? years. Y'all came and locked in for ten days. Now I'm on ten day contract. But influencers from Omaha, hit me up. You know what I'm saying? Uh, we want to get them sponsorship going on. You know, keep doing the shouts for the city. Yep. Uh, but yeah, we about to turn up this year. This is. It's gonna be a real city boy year. DJ Ray Bay party is coming up soon. She talking about thirty dollars per ticket. I'm gonna try to get that shit knocked down. <laughs> Tweaking, it's whatever. Thirty dollars. Yeah, that that was the uh, the freak Nick party oh, last year. That I'll we, pay sixty. That we, that we missed. This <laughs> this is gonna be a players club, and she said wardrobe is required. I just want to go to another pool party. But anyway, man. <laughs> another pool party. Never Appreciate y'all for tapping in with us. <laughs> we always want some buns. It's another episode of City Boy Podcast. We, we up, up, we up, we up. We up. We up.